That looks like one of Beck's Mysteriums. I thought they were gonna shut these down. Need some help? The Mysterium is infected with a virus or something, and it's trapped someone inside. If you execute the breakpoint condition, the system should reset. Just try not to get hurt in the process. How would I get hurt if it's just an illusion? That, my friend, is what we're trying to find out. data, but don't let that stop you from jumping in again. First things first, we have to put together a pitch for investors. Wait, Cole, are you recording? Yep, we're rolling. I don't understand why we have to record all this. Because we're all going to be famous one day. And our fans are going to want to peek behind the curtain, so to speak. Ugh. Okay. Well, for the pitch, I can put together a prototype illusion that will blow your mind. Great idea. We also still need to come up with a name for our attractions. How about... Mysterians? No. No, no. We will not use the name Mysterio in any way, shape, or form. People are going to call you Mysterio whether you like it or not. But I am not Mysterio anymore. I am Quentin Beck, Master Illusionist. Beck didn't want to be a bad guy anymore. Good for him. Oh, you found one of our dev diaries. This is a project Betsy was passionate about. Unfortunately, more people are trapped in Mysteriums throughout the city. But we must find out who is behind this and bring them to justice. This whole Mysterium thing feels shady. But if there are people trapped, I gotta help them. And try to figure out what's really going on. So the phone number on the impounded truck was the pre-1970s kind with letters. Harlem 7, 4321. Did the truck that got away have the same one? Yeah. But I'm not sure I'm following. Pre-1970s trucks were terrible polluters because they had no catalytic converters. My office did an initiative to get them off the roads. So there are now very few old trucks in this neighborhood. Si tuviéramos alguna forma de localizarlo. I got an idea. 
Nice work, Ma. Back in business. If Ma's right about those trucks, they probably left behind some kind of residue. Hey, Miles. I heard there's a star-studded gala at the museum. If I find the missing pieces, yeah. I've never yeah. been to a gala before. Do you want to go? I thought you'd never ask. What should I wear? Fierce black, low-key glam? Bro, let me focus. Right. Uh, good luck. I can't believe people would do this. I was so excited about this exhibit. The whole museum, really. Look, this is an unfortunate situation I'm in here. I mean, you know how much I care about protecting the collective history of this community. I do, which is why I hope this won't derail your support. Okay, let's see if those trucks left anything behind. Spider-Man's here. Spider-Man, any news? Working on some new leads. I'll let you know. Well, I've got business to attend to, but you know my feelings. For me, it's about preserving the history at all costs. Hey, Spider-Man. Now we know you're helping on this. You're good. Thanks. This looks like it could be something from a prehistoric heist truck. Ugh. Smell that sulfur. Definitely from an old engine. Maybe I can isolate it further. To identify the substance, we need to get rid of the contaminants. Aromatic hydrocarbon. This will never make it through a catalytic converter. Hey, Ma, you were right. That truck was so old, it left the unique contaminant in its wake. Fantastic. Can you track it down? On it as we speak. I suddenly have hope we might really be able to find everything, pull off the gala, and save the museum. Whoa, 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 whoa. One thing at a time. Okay, I know. Well, be careful. And let me know what you find. How many days ago was my last shower? Sorry, couldn't hear you. Anyway, we delivered everything we had. The rest of it fell off the truck. Then you better freaking find it! I understand, sir. We'll keep looking for the last item. He's stiffing us. What did I tell you? No. He'll pay when we deliver the saxophone. No, the saxophone. I think you'll know where. Settle down, idiot. This guy's loaded. Just need to make him happy. Uh-oh! Where's Spider-Man going down? Did you really think you seen the last of me? How the hell did the spider find us? More friends? Let's go. <laughs> Okay, that's all of them. Let's open up that truck and get the rest of those museum pieces. 
Empty? They must have already given their boss whatever was in here. All roads seem to lead to that guy. Sounds like somebody's phone. Okay. So there's something out there they're still looking for. So I found the second truck, but it was empty. Oh, no. But they lost one of the pieces somehow. Charlie Parker's saxophone. Oh, Miles, head over to CJ Walker Park. Okay, why? One of our interns said she heard a guy talking about a saxophone he found. I didn't believe her at first. She's kind of a bochichera. If it's the one these guys lost, the boss seemed really interested in finding it. As he should be. Charlie Parker's a legend. That saxophone is priceless. Who should I look for at the park? I don't have a name. They said a trumpet player was talking about it. Trumpet, got it. Thanks, Yaranita. Let me know what happens. Te quiero. <laughs> Gotta change clothes first. Don't want to disrupt the festival. Okay, where is this trumpet guy? This place looks a lot better today than it did when Fisk and his crew took it over. Hey, Miles. Steph, what's up? You here with Gloria? Nah, she's working. I just got here. Was looking for a trumpet player. You seen one anywhere? Yeah, Teo is here, playing his trumpet. Teo plays trumpet? Mm-hmm. I think he was over near that far gate. Great. Thanks, Steph. And say hi to Gloria for me. It's just the basic drums are good. And the volume of the group. Good volume dynamics make good relationship dynamics. Drum circle 101. Bye. How you been? Good. Busy. How's business at the barbershop? Booming, my friend. How you liking those locks? I like them. Took my mom a little while, but I think I won her over. Ah, well, just keep twisting. But they're looking good. Thanks. See you around. Thanks, everyone. Hey, Spider-Man. Hey, Miles. Teo, sounding good, man. Wow, I didn't know you played the trumpet. I dabble, I dabble. Hey, I was actually gonna call you. When I was in keynote music this morning getting my horn fixed, some kids brought in a sax they found on the street. I was thinking it could potentially be the one from the museum. I don't want to get anyone in trouble. I'm trying to do the right thing. Yeah, 100%. You talking about Keynote on Cathedral? Yeah, talk to Eugene. Thanks. Headed there right now. Trumpet sounds great, bro. Hey, Ma. Found the sax. On my way to pick it up now. Ay, bendito. Angela will be so relieved. This just might save the museum. Hey, did you know Teo played the trumpet? He's pretty good, too. Had an audience and everything. The whole park was bumping. Precisely why this museum is so important. Music enriches our community and brings it together. Is that my mom or Councilwoman Morales talking? It's both. Ten cuidado, mijo. Uh-oh. This doesn't look good. Hey, Spider-Man! 
I was about to put an alert in your app. What happened here? A couple of creepy guys just dragged Eugene out here. Definitely wasn't right. They went that way. Thanks. I'll check it out. Let's scan for any clues here. <laughs> Sledgehammer? Oh, these guys meant business. Better find Eugene fast. Oh, scuff marks. Looks like Eugene might have been dragged that way. Hey, fellas! You want to learn to play music? There are better ways to do it. Man, here comes the rest of the band. Spider-Man. You okay? A few bruises are okay, as long as they left me my keys. Here, take these and open my trunk. Charlie Parker saxophone. That's the real deal right there. I was getting ready to return to the museum, and those guys busted in. He used that to record his masterpiece, Ornithology, 1946. You a bird fan? <laughs> My dad was. I don't know much about old music. Mm, mm, old. <laughs> when you hear an MC today, you syncopated accents, stress the offbeat, flow in and out of the rhythm. That ain't number bebop. I have to listen a little closely next time. I'll get this back to the museum right away. Then I gotta call my insurance company. Okay, thanks, man. Right. Hmm. If I could get into the phone these guys were using to communicate with the mastermind. <laughs> All zeros is a number equivalent of password as a password. Just a midnight rendezvous with a criminal mastermind. No biggie. 